good was popping YouTube family. We back with another reaction video. And we got my boy Sensei. Yes, sir. And we got the Yujiro on my brother. Hey. Quick side note, go check out the uh, Daddy Fat Snap. Uh, Baki song, cause you know that. Hey, but before y'all do that though, stay here with me and sin, cause this is the Yujiro Hama, the Black Air Force D boy. Hey, you wanna talk about a demon? You wanna talk about a demon? Is that man Yujiro Hama? Man, hey, hey, never in my life have have I seen anybody do some nut ass shit like he's been doing <sighs> crazy but make sure y'all go to the description send channel gonna be linked down below along with the original video make sure you go show them some love hit the sub button i think i, I was thinking about this when i was walking earlier i know this is like a long distance away but when i hit like 5k I'm gonna do a Q and A. So like, if you wanna get to know me better, hit the sub button. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm you know, I'm kind of cool. I'm kind of cool. Oh, I'm like, hey, go so sense and love. You know what I'm saying? It's in the description. You go do that. If not, then I'm gonna treat y'all like how uh, you drove this right. You know what I'm saying? There are men who fight, and then there are men who are great at fighting. And then there are those that get knocked out in sixth grade by their school bullies. Like, why didn't you just give him the lunch money, bro? Just Sin? ordered an extra slice of pizza and now you knocked out. Now Sin? you face first in the urinal. Everybody calling you urinal cake. Like, I don't- Sin, what's up? <laughs> I'm, getting off, I'm getting off track. Why that sound there too detailed, Sin? What's up? Rated fighting. <laughs> and then there are demons. Today we are here to talk about one such demon. I will tell you a story about a man who single-handedly had two children that he not only paid child support for, he said f them baby moms, exactly. but he also neglected and abused them on the regular. On the regular. And the other was a motherfucking pill head, cause somebody helped this man jack out, like come on bro, this man got hella steroids and shit. like somebody get his- Look at him, fiending, my bad, my bad. fiending. Let's talk about a man who single-handedly stopped the United States military, a man who has killed all types of animals. Call Peter a polar bear, lions, giant elephants, animals, a man with a literal demon face on his back. And I ain't talking about having a demon on his back, like NBA young boy not chasing. We talking about I'm literal, talking about literal demon. demon face. I'm talking about literal there demon. Are men, there are gods. And then there's Yujiro Hama. And then there is Yujiro. <laughs> hey, right, so from the hey. intro, man, you know what time it is, bro. And please believe I've seen the comments, bro. Bro, you Ujiro video. Please do a Ujiro video. Ujiro this, Ujiro that. Why don't you Ujiro go get some bits? How about yeah, that? go oh, get damn, some, bro. That was trash. All right, yo. If that was trash, leave a like, bro. If that was hard, leave a like, bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. It was, it was, like, it was like mid, video, bro. Because I done seen a couple things that I'm working on, but I need to see a little bit of support, bro. I done seen mm. sin. I want the USK video. All right, cool. Sin. I want the JoJo Part Five video. Sin. I want the Attack on Titan video. Listen, listen, listen. I will do all three of those videos. Cool. I promise. I swear to God, I will do those videos if you get yeah. this video to 20,000 likes, bro. If you get this to 20,000 likes and 200,000 views, I swear to God, I will do all three of those videos yeah. right hand up to him but yo God, right yo, hand up to him video, bro for a minute bro because as soon as this man gets introduced bro we gotta call this a peter bro somebody <laughs> call peter somebody call the veterinarian organization <laughs> of america bro please <laughs> some veterinarians on the line bro this man he said some veterinarians he came in like bro this man ugo did not like coca-cola's growing up this man smoked the coca-cola bear off the earth like bro i ain't gonna lie bro you know what it's cold, bro, when he's smoking animal, bro. Takimura from Epo smoked a bear. Like, come on, bro. Yo, Yujiro. Man, we smoking a bear. bear. Like, also, Yujiro smoked the giant elephant. Also, Yujiro smoked the lion. Like, bro, Yujiro be smoking he, a lot, bro. Yo, don't let this bear him from the zoo. He beat a dragon. You know what I'm saying? From Shrek. I ain't gonna lie. Like, he beat the dragon. He beat a dragon. Beat and he hit the dragon. You feel me? Like, he on, beat shout, him. Shout out my man. <laughs> now, let me stop playing. But anyway, so this man smoked the polar bear off the early, bro. But let's fast forward to this Hanayama and Baki fight, bro. Because, oh my God, bro. And Baki the grappler and Baki Max some tournament this man Yujiro was a demon bro this man pulled up on Hanayama hello fight, bro. oh my god bro like bro you know when 
cold when he pulls up like P. Diddy, bro. Pulled up in the helicopter, bro. It's bad boy. It's bad boy for life. This man came out it's the helicopter and dropped in like he was in the Matrix. Bro jumped out the helicopter like Morpheus trying to get away from the Agent Smith. Yo, he jumps in there. First thing he says is, and you know I got to hit that hood translation for y'all. He was like, yo, what it do, Baki? Baki. Get psyched, nigga. Bitch ass nigga, you soft as hell. What is you talk? You not my son, you a weakling. And look at this big nigga with the tattoos. What you think you in a Yakuza game? Big buff ass nigga. for no reason, I'll drop you right now. Nigga. Stop playing with me. Like, he, he be talking, and it's like, bro, because ain't man, nobody in that room gonna back stop him. It up, though. I ain't gonna hold you, bro. He, was. Like, he had all types of cuts on his back, bro. Like, bro, hey, Adeyama, did somebody give you a 13th reason? Well, bro, as soon as this man gets Chill. here, dude, he starts punishing Hanayama. Hanayama was not for none of the bullshit, bro. He was like, yo, you know, I'm gonna hit you with that translation. He was like, like, Talk to him. Who the fuck is you talking to, boy? I will really get your fake Gogeta Super Saiyan 4 looking at. Like, he started talking kind of crazy. He was like, yo, stop playing. Okay, he got that. up. He ran up. He's like, hmm. big ass telegraphed ass swing. Me, please. Broke his leg. You don't punish this man, Hanayama, bro, badly. Look at him down on his last. I mean, he was already on his last from the Baki fight, but man, Yujiro came in here and just finished off the scraps. At this point, yo, he beat this so bad, they jumped into a flashback, bro. Now we get into a flashback where we get, like, this Yujiro Look at and Baki's it mom whole meeting, bro. Now, Baki's his mom, whole I ain't gonna lie. Life. I ain't saying she a girl. Don't dig they ain't messing with no bro. I ain't gonna lie. Baki's mom was a big, big gold digger, bro. Nah, I'm just playing. She wasn't really a gold digger, bro, but she was like kind of living that luxurious life. She came from nothing, bro. Like, and the dude that she was with, this slick ass John Travolta hairstyle, oh, so ass, Uncle Jesse ass. looking, like, bro. He looking like Steven Seagal and shit. Like, I ain't gonna lie. He's <laughs> clean. I, I ain't gonna hold you. Kind of looking like my man Razor Ramon. You feel me? Yeah, rest in peace to my man Scott yeah. Hall, by the way. You already know what it is. Much love. But yo, this yeah. man Yujiro's at this party. I ain't gonna lie. He in there with the Tuck's looking kind of clean. I, I ain't gonna hold you. They get in there, yo. Baki mom starts instantly choosing, bro. She start looking like, huh. And this man, Ujiro, looking back at her like, he could like get clean, though. Me. I like what she do to me. Like, bro, he was kind of talking crazy. Hey, like, he looking oh, clean, though. That look like, yeah. He started undressing her with her eyes and all that. Mm -hmm. She went biting her lip and sh This dude he said, here, hold he on, cuz. And I ain't gonna lie, bro. He channeled his inner Chris Brown on this one. He, he said, what? Like, he shit out of her. I'm like, bro, Chill. what's going on right now? How you just Whoa. slapping her? Nobody even did anything. He slapped her and everybody was shocked like, oh, oh my God. And then they went back to doing what they were doing. They ain't really care for real. They did not care. Yeah. At this point, this dude was tight at Ujiro, so he pulled up on him. But he had like John Wayne Gracie there. Like, this Gracie ass his name was actually Gracie. It was like some jujitsu master or something. And he, he got punished. Ujiro, like, he wanted to smoke. So, you feel me? He's like, let me fight for your He honor. got they punished. Get in the ring. I'm like, okay, what's about to happen? I ain't gonna lie, bro. He punished this Gracie. That you just, you did not work. He straight slapped this weave. Break up. Put this straight down. After this, yo, this man Ujiro said one of the coldest things I've ever heard of my goddamn yeah, life. Yo, he went to the room where she was at, bro. Looked her dead in her face and said, <clears throat> I've come to collect you. I said, you've come to collect her? Oh my God. <laughs> is she a Christmas <laughs> ornament? She's a bill collector, baby. Is about to take her to Pawn Stars. Like, oh, yo. In Pound she, Town. She Charizard. <laughs> Him. So her husband walks in the room while he's, he's in here shaking. talking to her and pulls the fucking blicky out on him, bro. And this is when I first really saw, well, besides the time that he killed a polar bear and then he knocked out Gracie. But this is when I really knew this was different, bro. When a n can kill a n got him, a like... gun to the back of her head, <sighs> bro, this man was looking like the black Detroit dude Urban dude. Survival you know Train. I'm talking about with the body armor. <laughs> he put the gun to the back of this dude, Ujiro head. He killed her husband, literally right in front of her. And she and liked that. No enjoyed this, bro. This n's neck. She smiled at him when he did it. I'm like, oh, this b the demon. She laid it. Don't lie. He looked her dead in the face again, yo. And guess what she said, dweeb? Oh my god, son. What did he say? Yo, dweeb. Guess dweeb. what he said, my Yo, said, tell me what he said. Guess what he said? What did he say? He said, You're gonna bear my son. Like, bro, this n look dead in her face. And he took her to pal town. Her dead husband was on the ground. This that's a demon. I ain't gonna lie, bro. He the pal so, anyways, we come back to life, yo. After he punished Hanayama, bro. Oh my god, he did Hanayama dirty, yo. So his wife went up to him, bro. Really on some clingy shit. I'm like, oh my god, bro. They in the bedroom. She, you know, she trying to get it on. You feel me? She feeling that Ujiro presence. You feel me? She wants some of that demon duh. You feel me? Yeah. Shout out my man Dash. You feel me? That duh. Mm -hmm, <laughs> you feel me? 
Okay, she it sounded like she was doing something to the deal. I don't the know. Do <laughs> I don't know. I actually ran up to the deal. Like a stone cold killer he is. He channeled his inner NFL, bro, and hit her with the meanest stiff arm ever. Knocked like, into a table. Give me six feet. Boom. Push it down. I'm like, oh my God, bro. But then he changed his mind after she got mad at him, yo. He's she like, came nah. and bit him and shit. He kind of got turned on and it made love to her anyway. How you push a bitch? With the stiffness of your arm, bro. And then you got still with the duh, And then you gave it to her. Bro, man, somebody just a Playboy partnership. Look, by the bro. one hand. Everybody. So Baki starts training after this, yo, because he's tight about this Hanayama fight. He's like, yo, f my dad, f my mom, yo. She really out here on this bush. I ain't f with none of these. Nah, he really did want a relationship with his mom, bro, but his mom was just so Wild. like caught up in him. It was yeah. weird, bro. The whole like he was so caught up in him. Like there was just some weird like Alabama type vibes going on sometimes Man. when she would like touch Baki certain ways, bro. And I wasn't really feeling that. Oh, 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 but anyways, this man pulls up on Baki while he's training and said, in one month, we will fight. Like, bro, you ain't even get this a choice. You just gonna tell him, yeah, hey, in a month, we gonna scrap. Like, bro, and what then you gonna do if he tell you that? find out if he's worthy of being your son. He's like, in one month, we'll fight. If you lose, you're not my son no more. Like, bro, that's like an adoption agency making the adoptees watch two little unarmed children fight each other for who Chill. can be the son. And that Chill. actually happened in the Maxim tournament with Jack and Bot. <sighs> It's crazy how things come full circle, y'all. Imagine is. that. Imagine. I to an adoption agency and those two kids scrapping for parents. That's basically what this man is on right now. Uh, you Imagine know, that he befriended Baki. You remember he, he he beat the ape up and then he brought the ape his like wife's head and. Sh this man Ujiro went and smoked him because he felt like he was weak. He's like that's not man. your friend. He was a weakling. Ah. Man. And put the his head in front of Baki. Man. And he like had the blood of his head and he like made Baki blind for a minute. Baki's trying to fight him. He can't even see what's going on. Got the blood of his bitch. But then Baki did some weird shit, bro. Let, let's talk about when he went to the edge of the cliff, yo. It was like the lake and all that. And he had like the, the teeth, teeth. Or the fang of this ape. Remember the fang that the ape gave him? Why did this nigga Baki eat that? Stick like now you Is can fight here with me. Like, Cause he weird. Look at his dad, like, and then look at his disgusting. mom. Weirdo. It made the crunchy noise and all that. Sound like he was eating chicken bones. But anyways, <laughs> uh, let's move on. So Yujiro wanted to see the prime minister, so he pulled up the scene. He bro. smoked all of them. It was a no contest. Looks him dead in the face, and he says, "One man versus a hundred cowards. It's the same as a one v one." Like, bro, like, he's it is. Saying like, he, all are the equivalent of one, one person. Man. It is, and they were. It's to their face. That's crazy. It's a punishing all of them. Goes to the prime minister, and he. Like, yo. Here, and he meets a guy that he's friends with. I guess this guy's uh, like a weapons master or something. But he had this titanium alloy bow and this bow and arrow, bro. He tells this. I want you to try to kill me with it. Now I'm looking at this little dude, and I ain't gonna lie, bro. It looked like Bret Hart with a kimono one, bro. Had the slick back joint. I ain't gonna hold that, you. I didn't know if this that's good is or not. I'm like, that's bro, good. Get some product out of your hair. I swear to God, if you put a lighter near him, his head would explode. But that's, that's they are good, there, bro. Though. He pulls the bow out, bro. And before he could even pull the bow, this man Yujiro on a teleport <sighs> next to him. The arrow before it even released. He didn't even this get man, off the, the, the demon, thing. Bro. Like the demon on his back. Like he needs an, uh, a black Air Force imprint on his back. Black yeah, tennis. get a tattoo. Something. something. Bro, black Cross. The next um, thing we see Ujiro in, though, man, was kind of sus, bro. This man in a motherfucking Speedo flexing, bro. I ain't gonna lie. He is flexing in front of a shorty, though. So I guess it ain't really that crazy. He punched the sweat off. He turned on by his own reflection. He does this again, yo, in the, like, the newer Baki and the Netflix. He's like sitting in the hotel room spread out. Bro, he be flexing, stretching his leg, putting it behind his ear. Like, bro, if you don't get your freaky ass somewhere, like, what you gonna do about it, though? We can't do nothing about it. Yeah, hold on. <laughs> I'm just saying, you ain't gonna make me act up. You sure? I'm just saying. But, hmm? yo, she went to go grab hey, her man, yo, and get stiff arm again. Bro, this keep stiff arming this bitch. At this point, yo, I'm just like, yo, you do not want her, bro, clearly. And he just wanted for the yeet. He look her dead in the face talking about, I wanted a son, and he gave me Baki. I'm like, what you want? <laughs> he called Baki his daughter. Like, bro, this nigga different. Like, bro, this man out here assuming Baki nah, gender. Like, bro, yeah, come on. Like, it got crazy. Yo, LGBTQ and all that. You feel me? They gonna, they gonna cancel this. Like, he better relax. She all mad as Running out of the hotel crying like, why won't he love me? I gave him that Gucci and that go go three thousand so many he times. He gave him a BS son. Baki is nah, but Baki a demon though. Baki. She started punching Baki and she boom boom we. It's your we, fault. We, 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 uh, why won't he love me, Baki? Baki, I try to give him everything. I don't know. Is it is it because I don't season my food? Like <laughs> I, I I don't know what it is. She mad as hell. Why don't you get your clingy ass? Right. Like this Baki, uh, his weird ass. He starts begging for her love as she's talking about Ujiro. She get mad, starts punching him even more, and it bites the. Like, 
like, bro, what's up with you with biting? Like, everybody Free. that comes around Baki's mom got to get a tetanus shot. I'm going to come all the way clean. So, you anyways, me. fast forward. You got a bad bro, bro. You're finally about to fight, bro. The whole squad is here. It's mad, bro. Like, everybody's here to watch this, bro. But right before they fight, a f earthquake happens. And I'm like, first off, are they in California? Like, what is this? San Andreas? What is this? 2011? Mm -hmm. like, what is happening right now? Why is there a random earthquake happening when they're about to fight? And then this. Ujiro literally punches the ground and I'm like, is he mad? He getting his frustrations out because there's an earthquake? This and then the earth just stopped. The earthquake. This punched the ground so hard. The it just stopped. earthquake stopped. He was like, no interruptions. I'm like, God damn. Now imagine Here, you Urban getting hit by that. Mad. So this man Baki goes, he's come straight in trying to choke Ujiro out, bro. But everybody is looking like, is like, oh, it looks like a dad is holding a son on his back. It looks like this giving Baki a piggyback ride. Yeah. He basically gets mad at this and flings his Baki off like a bug, smacks his off like a house fly, swats him like a mosquito, throws this. Yo, you know you that n you use one hand and you throw a grown ass man. Baki was hitting this n a million and times not and did literally nothing. nothing bro. He's Nathaniel. He was punching this so many times, bro. And this Ujira was literally unfazed, bro. It literally wasn't even affecting him at all. He's having a full blown conversation with the people on punched. the sidelines. And while this all happened, he called the whole crowd weaklings while he was getting punched. He's like, oh, Baki just the king of the misfits. Like, damn, he said y'all all bitches and he's the king of the bitches. Is. Like, bro, he started punishing. Then, yeah. Like, this episode then was at one point, he planted that. It man. wasn't because nobody yeah, right. was saying that. Nah, he planted that. Because he was putting this Baki to sleep. Said he could have killed him twice in one tenth of a second. Like, bro, how fast and how dangerous do you have to be? He's like, gotta keep Real your dangerous. Up, son. I could have killed you twice in one tenth of a second. Like, god damn. You know how quick that is. When Ujiro was punching the sh out of Baki, bro. So, his mom <laughs> intervened. Like, he's on top of Baki, literally going to Pound Town on Paul. She's Pound Town. Yes, Pound Town. Oh, yes. Oh. Anyways, he's on top of this man Baki, literally rocking him. Beak it, beak it, beak it, beak it. Beam, beam, beam. About damn near so plenty, so Baki, much, bro. That his mom got in it, bro. You know that he was punishing him because his mom literally don't give a fuck about Baki, bro. I ain't gonna lie, she rocked that. Bro, hit that with a clean one. Mickey punched her so wrist, hard and broke her wrist, bro. Her fucking hand was limp. I ain't gonna lie. She went to grab him and he killed her. <laughs> this, <laughs> what? Oh my god, bro. This thing is different, bro. Like somebody Man, please spot this hey. away and throw away the key, bro. Like, bro, please, the feds, somebody hit he, this he, with a new bro. He killed he her. He caught him as he takes an explosion, man. How you gonna kill your wife and then you gonna act like her pimp at the same time? Like, yeah, I was getting tired of this prostitute ass. It's like, bro, god damn. Bro, at this point, yo. The police officer walked up like, bro, there's a lot of things I can let you get away with, but not killing a woman. He backhanded yeah. the police officer. Man, what is he gonna do? Blink, hit this what was he gonna do? Fist. Bro, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Give him an award. Anytime I see 12, get fucked. I'm like, I'm with that. I ain't gonna hold you. Then Damn he literally too. punished everybody. The whole there, crowd bro. because he, he was just like, I'm bored. The whole battlefield because he was bored, as he called him. And then he was bored. His helicopter like and did did he once again? This thank he Sean did he Combs I hopped in a fucking helicopter. What is this GTA 5? He like, oh, dang, my son God, charged. Bro, he like, my son Garbo. This the rest of this episode. This is the old nerd ring. You feel me? His mom's ring hallucinating, talking to her, talking to my uh, 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 after image. Like, bro, this weird ass. N anyway, fast forward to season two, bro. And we got Baki, and he's in his Maxim tournament, bro. But there's like this pre tournament, I think. Or like, it's like a pre. I don't remember exactly, bro. Anyway, he's in I the middle of his about, mom's though. ring, bro. And this man, Ujiro, showed up and stopped him with one finger, bro. He beat this. Turned his brain one out. One finger. Like, turned his brain off. Punish this, bro. When you get beat by one finger, you're a bitch, bro. Like, the only time you should get beat by a finger is, is thumb wrestling, bro. Like, he's. That's true. Just, Ujiro's different. This is when we first meet Dopo Orochi, bald ass. This fucking buff. Mr. Clean looking ass, it's stumpy looking at it. Call him stumpy because he lost his stump in the new body, bro. bro. <laughs> Not lost his stump, but his hand. Oh, okay, Mega Man on oh, bro. Oh, oh, bro. Bro. Ujiro, bro. We find out Dopo Orochi's mad at Ujiro because this n had scars on his face put there by Ujiro, bro. We find out, yo, because this Dopo Orochi was literally sitting at a table eating, having drinks. What do you think Ujiro was gonna happen? Walked up, snuck this n and punished him for no reason. He had no reason to do it, bro. This man was he just, just walking did away. It. The next guy I see him a slice their face open. Yo, he cut this n***a's face open. Bro, I can't no even believe that bro. this even happened. So anyway, so he walked off. to their fight, bro. He punishes this n***a, bro. He tells this n***a dope old Roche. There, this is there's nobody he says, I reward that Ujiro you has not punished. Than last time. Like, bro, you know when the n***a snuck you, cut your face open, and you had the confidence to think you could fuck with him because he snuck you, and then he punishes you again and says, I'm going to reward you with an ass whooping. Like, bro, yeah. when the n***a 
nigga rewards you with more hands. That's like, insane. This, Robin, like, bro, this nigga, yeah. oh my god, it was getting punished. We switch his stance up and everything. They talking about this man, Ujiro, got a stance that can't even be countered. He literally can't be countered by any side. You Look, have yo, to he fight punching, him physically. punching, so kicking everything. But I know your bones are just gonna lose. Get walking up with the presence of a fucking Susano. You, know, you don't know what to do. Right. I ain't gonna lie. Dopo started fighting back a little bit. Started punching this nigga in the chest. You feel me? Due to his pride being hurt. But this nigga wasn't even harm, man. Ujiro was literally eating all the punches. Yeah, he was like, you doing good. And then Baki came out, bro. And this was a mistake, bro. Baki should have stayed behind stage. Because as soon as he came out, this nigga, Ujiro's whole pride kicks in, bro. This man's like, yeah, I'm about to start flexing on He said, yeah, I can't play with you no more. Chest. So he started punishing Dopo Orochi at this point, bro. Showing this demon back and everything, yo. Dude, everything Baki coming out, bro. His pride overkilling like because Baki was there. This man flexing like, bro, if you don't get your world's strongest man competition built, that's Mark here, Henry bro, built. Posing this shit, bro. I ain't gonna lie though. He punished right back Orochi, shoulder you know, this nigga with his demon punch attack, and he stopped this nigga Dopo Orochi's heart while he was standing. Bro, they had to do some sort of like super weird like brought him back. Yeah, that wasn't a lobotomy. What is that? That's when you take a brain out. What? What did I even get that from? I think my girl be saying that. I ain't, I ain't gonna lie. But they did some weird ass surgery on us. Put a needle in him. Some weird dude brought him back like bro they had to do some weird ass like to bring that man like back jutsu just to bring this nigga back anyways fast forward though we meet this man jack hama bro the perky set nigga himself man the perky perky turkey all these perks like got my laundry man this drucky ass nigga, bro all he do is pop steroids small ass body frail ass body bro he's big as hell when he's on the roys bro but as soon as them roys wear off bro this man out of steam bro this man Nagato. like gear for luffy we need a stamina break like goddamn damn near deflated bro, <laughs> on episode of spongebob <laughs> <laughs> those them blow up arms and none of them shits worse like god damn anyways baki gets in between of jack and yujiro bro and that demon ass the palm the f out of baki's face and pushed him into the wall like get the f out of the way brat i'm like god damn bro cartwheeled into the wall bro the animation was mad hilarious like editor run that back a few times bro but play that like music while it's happening you a fool you a fool like that music bro but play that back mm -hmm. but how this, this car wheeling over and over yo no, what kind of animation was that anyways flashback to young you so bro right. this was literally fighting hey. in the army and not using weapons tanks and explosion bro, on his it was back too easy for him he needed a challenge bro this it was smoking soldiers as soon as we get into the flashback you know you're a demon when you're killing in the first scene of a flashback literally smoke the whole shit but there's no guns just hands and feet make it mock up move it mock up and then he broke a gun by bending it that's not even the first time he did this either bro, bro was just out here destroying he metal with his bare hands and he destroyed their ship bro blew their whole he ship running off and say hold on he bent that gun like <clears> a cartoon <throat> where like you pulled a gun out and then, like, yeah. would, like bend it so you'll send me sam would like shoot himself like that's how he bent that shit. anyways was underground eating sonic the hedgehog and shit. man was out here eating knuckles and shit. like bro he seen this groundhog and just killed it started eating it raw like bro what is going on bro out here looking like oh he's eating an rats animal, and bro. The king. him so, and mary leona bro the king weirdos there, yo, yeah, you photo or not you photo because my uh uh uh, 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 uh antiplex be tripping bro don't don't do that anyways he heard some soldiers walking past him he jumps out of the ground from i don't know how far down he was underground bro this in a whole nother subterranean bro jumps through the ground and punishes all these soldiers then we meet diane Steele, bro i think her name is diane but he called her jane i don't know some blonde hair oh she smokes these with a machine gun after he destroys them she was talking heavy to this good old talking about yeah you ain't been around a woman before you only 16 i'd have heard about you virgin and little dick and they started talking crazy he starts walking away so she goes to turn around yo and is greeted with his fucking fingers in her mouth he's like, like i could kill you right like yeah. an orange right now and there's nothing you could do about it this man was putting the duh up on her back had his fingers in her mouth like a fish she hook. was memorizing like, she was like hold on had some dirt in your fingers hey bro what's covid out bro you probably gave her a bacterial infection in her mouth who oh, knows what you was doing oh i do know you was eating a raw <laughs> groundhog right but anyways he ends up slapping the shit out of her too i'm like bro this has been slapping since the dawn of time she puts a gun to him Watch and out. guess what he did <laughs> you guessed it right bent the 
fucking gun again. Bro, they was in this. What can you do with about you, Jiro, bro? The commanders and shit, generals and shit. They was calling this a walking nuke, bro. He like, is. And he tanked one. Bro, what kind of fucking All is that, bro? Right. This man is a walking bomb that could kill whole countries, whole cities. Like, bro, That's this, 16. This is so this motherfucker. Uh, I think it was Strohan, I think is his name. He's talking to this man, Ujiro, bro. This man, Ujiro, grabs this nigga Strohan up and then has his own men smoking him to try to get Ujiro. He wasn't even there. Thank God, it the best on his own men was right. about to smoke him to get rid of Ujiro. That's how you know he's a demon. Like, bro's like, Sarge, my bad. He was like, hey, he we got to get him out of here. Anyways, after this, this get was him running out. through a base with Diane, and they tried to set the He said, hold on. But he is not dumb. He's like, how did you know about this secret tunnel that they built? They built it mad long ago. He ends up smacking her again, and puts her to sleep, and then he goes <clears> out with her fucking dead hanging ass body they start <coughs> shooting at him through her too i'm like bro they will literally smoke anybody to get to you jiro bro like god damn he walks over to the general grabs this by the face and breaks his neck in front of him too i'm like bro i can't even believe this bro, bro. he this taking explosion literally smoking bro. everybody anyways we go back to real time at this point jack and baki done happen i might talk about the max and tournament if y'all want yo also yeah if you get them likes like i said bro i'll do that i'll do yeah, that too do if y'all want that yo let me know in the comments do that. anyways this man jack done lost bro so this go and cut this jack jugular vein this man bleeding out like bro somebody get his health kit some bandages a 50 shield something you need a slurp juice out this needs that quick revive like god damn you need this a run up something. with a bleeding jugular vein bro and gets punched dead in his into the ground this you jiro like <laughs> what kind of idiot loses twice in one day i'm like bro then we get to the last episode of this Maybe, bro man, we hey. got this Okay, you Jiro, bro. Oh my god, bro. They on a special mission just to smoke you Jiro. They sent the green berets and the navy seals after this n He literally smoked oh, them all, bro. This oh, is what? one part where they tricked this to fall in a pit of spikes with grenades. This n sets off all the grenades, jumps out, blinds them all with the explosion, and then makes them all shoot each other. <sighs> the lead is like, stop, stop shooting. By that point, everybody got smoked. This n took out everybody. They even sent this m Unchained Biscuit Oliver out of him and it didn't was, even work. Me, no. oh, sent the roast beef himself. This man Biscuit Oliver big as shit, bro. This, you don't get this yeah, goddamn he, smoky like though. Mark Henry. Like, if you don't get your Chuck Roast built exactly. ass out of here, look like a Chuck Roast in a Hawaiian shirt. <laughs> Ain't no goddamn shit. <laughs> Anyways, bro, before I end this video, man, I gotta talk about one more thing, bro. Oh my god, bro. I've spoke about this before, bro, but it's a Ujiro video, so we gotta talk about the wheelchair fight, bro. I think it was the newest Baki on Netflix, not Baki Hama, but the one before that, the second season, bro. This man is fighting this old ass scaly looking ass in a wheelchair, bro. Bro's skin is messed up, first off. Can we talk about this man's skin? Bro yeah. is looking like reptile from Mortal Kombat, like, bro. Bro he looks like a egg. salamander, bro. Bro looks like a dumb extra lizard. love. Like, what is going on with your skin, bro? It looks like somebody smacks you in the face with a bunch of tacks. Like, bro, your face and <laughs> skin, some your dumb whole body extra is, love. You're scaly. Like, bro, what, what is going on, bro? Bro look like a, a mutated lizard. Like, he's like that one Spider-Man. Like, bro, what is going on with your he skin? Mad slow, Somebody get this some lubriderm something, nigga. Neo's born for that any Those are water. Like cream, like be Botox or something. Anyway, Kim K got. I ain't gonna hold you. Oh, so he needs scrapping, bro. I ain't gonna hold you. This in a wheelchair, bro. <laughs> My God, this man Ujira walked this out here, bro. First off, you're a demon. You walk the out here. You're about to smoke in a wheelchair, but old dude was giving Ujira them hands. He was giving. He, big, he was big, giving work. Big, 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 big. Beam, beam. This man he was giving work. Question that he was like, bro, that's not even my dad, bro. I don't even know who this is right now, but that ain't my dad. Then this man Ujira started turning up, bro. As soon as you got him riled up and Baki said that, bro, he started beating the he brakes said, off of boy, this old ass, who, bro. I mean, he was beating the senior citizen off this. He was beating the social security checks out of this nigga. He was, every time he hit him, you just seen coins dropping. This nigga hit him so hard, it looked like Mario when he stepped on a spike, bro. This is look like my Sonic when the coins come out, bro. He was beating the shit out of this nigga. Beat the scaly skin off this nigga. He beat this so bad and faked his death. Stopped his own heart to not catch the fade. You know you're a demon when you make a nigga kill himself and they weren't even really dead. Bro said, f all that. I'd rather stop my own heart than to get punished by this in this goddamn arena <laughs> right now. Bro, you just was so confused. I, right? like, wait, wait, wait. I ain't gonna lie, this look like he 147, but uh, this you Jiro scared him in a said, bro, he was beating bro, my bro, ass, bro, bro. This man you Jiro is a goddamn demon, bro. I swear to God, bro. There's there, there's not too many people that have as much black air force energy as this, bro. Like that. Like, I'm glad my man CJ put this nigga the round table, bro. This yeah. need to go at the round table. This need to go at the head conglomerate. You need to go at the ISS. Court system, bro. Like, 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 I don't know where this need to go, bro. But Underground. He, he black Air Force energy, bro. Black Timberlands. Black, you know, he got black shacks on. Like, this nigga, the Uggs and all that. Like, bro, this need to goddamn. Hey, you, 
Jude is a demon. Black everything, bro. Like, it's nothing you can do with that nigga, bro. What are you going to do with Yujiro Hanma, nigga? Not a damn thing. Not a damn thing, bro. Because Yujiro Hanma, I promise you you're there. Hey. Hey, I don't want to smoke with you, Jerome. <laughs> that's one. That's one of the few many people I don't want to smoke with. But no, nah, can't wait for Baki to come back or start. I don't know. Did it start back up? Somebody let me know. But because I know we've been, we we getting introduced to Gramps, ain't we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We getting introduced introduced to Gramps, Demon. But uh, make sure y'all go to the description. Same channel gonna be linked down below in my original video. Um, if you feel like you can box with Yujiro, let me know because uh, you're insane. And catch y'all next one. Peace.